On December 15, an F-35B crashed while landing at the Fort Worth base in Texas, the United States. The pilot ejected safely. What caused America's most advanced vertical takeoff and landing stealth fighter jet to crash? Before I break it down for you, please subscribe to my channel, share and comment, thanks. First, let's look at the video of the crash. Oh, he just crashed. Oh, shit. The video shows the pilot attempting a vertical landing. According to local media reports, the F-35B was conducting a hover test when it fell too fast to the ground in what is also called a heavy landing, causing the nose landing gear to snap and the F-35B to lose control. The pilot had to eject. We have yet to see anything credible to confirm the cause of the crash, but there are two distinct possibilities. 1. The F-35B experienced a malfunction during a hover or vertical landing, and 2. Pilot error. I think the first is more likely. If we watch the video carefully, we can see the F-35B's engine belching out white smoke at one point. As the stealth fighter began to hover, faint white smoke appeared at the main spout. As the F-35B descended, a thick plume of white smoke was emitted. White smoke from jet engines is not normal. The most common possibility is lubricating oil leakage. That would cause parts to wear out and fail, leading to loss of thrust, and the F-35B would accelerate toward the ground. It's worth noting that the heavy landing did not directly cause the F-35B to crash. The direct cause is the plane snapped its nose landing gear, bounced back into the air and began spinning out of control. This suggests that after the F-35B's heavy landing, the lift fan may have been damaged and the aircraft lost its balance. When the fighter landed, the F-135 PW-600 engine not only pumped down its own main nozzle, but also turned a lift fan behind the cockpit through a long drive shaft. If the lift fan had been damaged during a heavy landing, the F-35B would have been out of balance, and the pilot would not have been able to control the aircraft as it began to spin, leaving him with no choice but to bail out. In addition, there was more white smoke coming from the engine at the last minute, further raising the possibility of an oil leak. Of course, this is all speculation on my part, and we need to wait for the results of the official US investigation. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe again. Thanks.